Next video. I went to the incest capital of America. Home, Alabama. A great song to some and an incest meme to most. Seven months ago, I met this guy while I drove through Alabama. Well, rumor has it they uh, fornicate with their siblings down here. Well, I go across town when you go across Tyler's so unbearably unfunny sometimes. It's like, you know that joke I made during the, the, co the Code Blue Camp video? It's like that, but like repeatedly, like like every once in a while. It with their siblings down here. Why go across town when you go across the hall? <laughs> so today I drove 17 hours to the incest capital of America. I do like that he's switching up his content though. He is swapping it around. He doesn't do those like cringe videos anymore. One simple question. The question is, do people in Alabama slam jam cousins? Uh, probably. You know someone who's kissed their cousin? Yes, sir. Yeah. Yeah. No. One of my cousins on that side of the family decided to do some stuff with my other cousins. You ever kiss your sister? Yeah, no. Nope. Did it ruin the family? I don't really talk to them that much. Okay, so if we keep looking, we will find someone? You're right. Okay. And sure enough, I found someone. You, you considered making love with your cousin or no? <laughs> no, I'm not that <laughs> What about kissing? Yeah, 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 I've done it. Oh, you've done it? So what gave you the urge to kiss your cousin? I ate. She was hot, I was hot. We were both 17. <laughs> and I was visiting my aunt and uncle and... And things happen. Yeah. They well, this is Alabama. My grandparents were second cousins. Oh my God. Wow. Bro, he was at a Walmart just walking around talking to people about incest. And he found someone that is giving an in depth fucking story on this shit. Did you kiss your first or second cousin? She was my first cousin. And she's beautiful. Where can I find someone who's made love with their cousin in Alabama? I need the inside scoop. Battle of South. South. Where? Mumford, Alabama. Mumford, yeah. Is that South or North? Uh, South. Roll Tide, baby. Why Mumford. do they know a fucking city? Is that like an actual incestual city? Munford. Do people in Munford fuck their cousins? Do you think that's a bad Google search? I'm going to word that differently. Do people in Munford commit incest? And now it's showing me sex offenders in Munford. Okay, that's not what I want to see. Here we come. Yeah. So I got on the road heading south to the city of Munford and stopped by Birmingham on my way where I accidentally found my second lead. Have you ever rodeo railed a cousin? No, dude. Why do you think that's a uh, stereotype? Uh, probably that that blue family online. There's a family that was so incested they turned blue. Like the Smurfs? Like real sh I think they're from Alabama. Do you have any last words? Um, just get money. <laughs> With a blue Smurf incest family. That's not a funny comment. They might be like second or like third cousins. You can legally marry your third cousin in the United States. Because you're basically not related. E like in the U.S., outside of the U.S. So if they're third cousins, that wouldn't surprise me. Because there's probably people that are married that are third cousins that don't even know they're third cousins. They lead on my radar. I headed further south and finally arrived in the city of Munford. Excuse me. Can I interview you for five bucks? Hey, what's up? Have you kissed a cousin? Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> Is she hot? Yeah. Honest <laughs> Fucking hell. So? Oh, yeah. Would you smash? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be honest with you, I ain't gonna lie to you. Here's five dollars. Right. And where are we right now? Mumford, Alabama. Have you ever kissed a cousin? No. Would you ever think about it? No. Do you have any words to all the cousin kissers out there? Quit. <laughs> Quit it while you're ahead, right? Right. You wouldn't kiss a Bro, five bucks. This man just said he would fuck his cousin on camera. That is nuts. That is nuts. Not even like, hey, can you say this? Like, just asked him, bro said, yeah. Sister, though. Yeah, if I had a sister, I would. Yeah? If she'd look good enough, and you know what I'm saying? What do you have to say to other cousin kissers out there? Well, he just said he would kiss his sister. Oh, my God. That was a delayed reaction I had on that one. Oh, my God. No. No. What's out there? Quit. <laughs> Quit it while you're ahead, right? Right. You wouldn't kiss a sister, though. Yeah, if I had a sister, I would. Yeah? If she'd look good enough, and you know what I'm saying? What do you have to say to other cousin kissers out there? Each their own. Yeah? <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> You're the man, brother. We had found a cousin kisser, but I wanted to find a legitimate smurf. And this guy gave me some advice. Give me a full list of the cousin kisser cities. You gotta go, you gotta go south, man. Okay. More south than here. While we have met several cousin kissers, the consensus is we have to go further south. But on my way to take a massive dump in this generic fast food chain's toilet, I ran into the cousin kisser again. Yo, we meet again. <laughs> you, you guys just meet? We live together, actually. Right. Right. I, I just got out of Cam County Jail, man. Okay, congrats there. on the freedom. Yeah, thank you, thank you. <laughs> you know a few folks out here. 
besides our good friend right here. What up? <laughs> What's up? <laughs> Look, I can't be dropping names, but I mean. Yo, this guy's a character. I feel like I've seen somebody that's exactly like him in like a movie. There's some uh, cousin lovers. Harold and Kumar. Harold and Kumar. Fuck. I've seen him. Oh my God. No, sister incest. Oh God, I don't know if I should Google this. Here it is. I found it. Does that look anything like him? It does? Okay. Fucking hell, dude. Oh my God. Okay. Some sister brother. Yeah. I, Where? Blue Mountain. Blue Mountain? If you're brave enough to go to Blue Mountain. All right, boys. Yeah. We're, go we're going to Blue Mountain, boys. Yeah, look, I, it's time. It's, it's time. time. Yeah. They don't find your answer. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. I'm nervous. Blue Mountain is apparently a legendary location. It's a DLC map. This is an insane journey. Alabama has exceeded my expectations and then some. Blue Mountain, here we come. So I drove to Blue Mountain and I wondered to myself, is this where the legendary spot? Our family lives. As Don approached and I got closer to Blue Mountain, clear that this place was sketchy as hell. So I went to Dollar General to see if I could add a backup NPC to my party just in case things got weird. I'll interview someone here for $5. Anyone interested? You down? I'm gonna give you $5 up front. What city are we in? Anderson. Oh, where's Blue Mountain? I thought we were in Blue Mountain. Blue Mountain is a block on the head. We're trying to find someone who's kissed their cousin. That's the goal here. Do you know where we might go? Blue Mountain. Do you know someone personally? No, I don't. Have you ever thought about kissing your cousin? Yeah. Did you do it? No. I respect that. Yeah. Would you like to go to Blue Mountain with us? No. <laughs> Do you have any hot takes? Uh, <laughs> careful Good around luck. here. Careful? Good luck? Mm -hmm. Good luck. There's decent people. Just watch where you're going. Just don't kiss me, one. Just don't kiss him. Don't kiss him? Hell no. What if I kiss him on the mouth? Dude, is that like a normal thing in like southern states like like Alabama to just know that like one city is just full of people that like do it with their cousins? <laughs> with it's even just more like a normal thing there. More warnings and no backup. I pushed onward I was to say Blue no. Like what I feel like I feel like how is he finding these people that are saying that? Mountain alone. This place looks awfully dark and scary. All I know is they told us to keep our head on a swivel and be on guard at all times. If you were to stop with no gas, you're just gonna get Ooh. Excuse me. Can I interview you for a dollar? No. Okay, no worries. Can I interview you for a video? Two dollars? Tyler also looks pretty muggable. Like, I feel like like he he doesn't look like a very intimidating person, like to the effect of like, okay, if I go to mug him, he's not gonna stab me. Like he looks like you could just pick pickpocket him and run away, and then he would be like pissed. Two bucks? What about five bucks? No, you all right? But apparently I pissed this guy off because after eight straight rejections, my cameraman told me this. He, he flashed his gun at me. What? Which one? Red car? A uh, guy that wasn't a passenger. She gave me a peace sign original. I said, which one? Which one? Which one? We need to go. We need to go right now. We need to go right now. Get me out of here. Throw me out of here. And then he walked out. Nah, I would dip fast as fuck too. No lie. Somebody flashes their gun at me. All right, man. I get it. I'll leave. The his shirt showed me his gun. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna press you anymore. I don't give a fuck about the content at that point. All right, you flash your gun. I'll leave. I'll go to another city. Um, probably not a best idea to be here. Okay, this will be our last location, then we're peeling it out of here and we're going south. Have you ever considered kissing a cousin? No. You know anyone who has? Yes. Do they tongue kiss? I don't know. Would you suspect that they might? Probably. Does that make you uncomfortable? It does. Can I interview you for five dollars? For six dollars, you can. All right, it's a deal. You guys are in a complicated situation, ship. No, we're in a relationship. So you guys are not related by blood, though. No. Would you guys date if you were related by blood? No, absolutely not. I mean, it, weird, at some right? point, it's so, I mean, somewhere down the road, you have to have some sort of relationship. That's where are you from? I'm from Alabama too. This is kind of weird. She almost said something mad weird there. Question. Like, what do you mean? This is like, would we date if we? Why is it a, but that's the whole premise of the, the question, right? That's why you got six dollars. Cousins can, like cousin brothers marry sisters all the time. Where are brothers marrying sisters? Oh Somebody's asking why are you asking this? You got the six bucks. You can't ask any questions. I asked the questions, pal. A few people that have Tell me about it. That's why I'm here to ask. So you know <laughs> Yeah, this is good. Railroad roaded or I'm not gonna freeway fornicated? No, I'm not doing that. I'm a teacher, I'm not doing that. Drive by jam and slam? You should why are you asking the questions you don't have to answer? Okay, my bad. Would you like to answer? For for what? The scoop on the sisters? No. Where can we find a cousin kisser? Mm. Probably go south more. Thank you guys. Bye. My take well, why do they just keep saying go more south? I feel like eventually you would meet like hippies that are by the beach. We need to go south. Question is, like, will the cops revert. be called on us? I just saw the guy dial like three buttons. Kill it, kill it, kill it. Like I would always associate people that are doing incest. I mean, this is stereotypical. But I would, I would always associate people that are doing incest with people that don't live near the coast. People that would live like in the deep south, in like the like in the woods, like somewhere over the fuck here, in the middle of 
nowhere. Gaping Blue Mountain unharmed, I headed as far south into Alabama as I could wow. go. Five hours deep into the backwoods, I stumbled upon an unexpected scoop. This gas station's on the ground. That tractor's four-wheel drive right now. It's an Alabama moment right here. <laughs> How you doing today? Good, all right. What city are we in right now? You're in the backwoods called Wing, Alabama. Do you know anyone who's called kissed their Wing, Alabama? Cousin out here. Dude, so I wish I had a cool ass accent. Uh, yeah, you're you're out here and called Wing, Alabama. We've been out here maybe three, four, maybe five years. I'm around, but I, I got some dumbass New Jersey accent. I'm not calling no names. <laughs> got it. <laughs> So, which direction should I go, though? Manifest just redeemed do accent of choice. What accent would you like me to do? Max, for the 300 minutes, have you tried Prime before? I have. Formar for the sub. And Max, thank you for the gift. It's again. What accent does Max want me to do? Or not Max, Manny. What the fuck am I saying? Did I say Max? Let's hear a deep southern accent. A deep southern accent. Wait, hold up. I gotta hear somebody talk. I, I'm good at replicating accents. I'm not. I think I am, though. Someone has kissed their cousin out here. They some around, but I, I'm not. They say some around here. Uh, they're really, they're really out here to be kissing their cousins and stuff like that. Me, personally, though, no, I never ain't messed with that stuff in my entire life. The people, the people out in maybe deep, deep Alabama, uh, you know, you never know. Uh, I do know this man named, uh, John, John Smith. Uh, his son, Carl, uh, is really into his cousin, right? I, he took her, he took her to prom, too. Uh, so I don't really know, I don't really know if that was a good decision on his part because his, his friends did bust his nuts a little bit bit on that one i mean literally they smacked him with a bat um so i i don't know i would I, I wouldn't i wouldn't i don't know i wouldn't know where you could find one outside of him calling no names <laughs> got it <laughs> so which direction should i go though i'd go right up the road here that's vegetable stand Ooh, vegetable yeah. stand after you pass the church just go check that out go up there and talk to him oh the guy at the stand yeah young guy <laughs> okay is he, uh... Find the vegetable stand. Dating his cut? All, all right, we'll check it out. Well, you got shotgun to the face. It's possible. Whoop, stomp, kick, beat. Straight right. The good old teeth stomping. They could that the old mud flapper. You getting curb stomped. But all, all around here, every curb's filled with mud. So not only does it break your teeth, you also get a little pudding stain all around your face. It's the vegetable stand. All right, done. Stop making me do accents. An incest baby. That time I did it willingly. All right. The product of cousin kissing, if you know what I mean. We're entering an unpaved road. What could go wrong? This is a good sign. Hand painted gourd. Let's make America great again. Birdhouse. This has got to be it. Let's investigate Bird further. House. Hey there. Jesus, 2020. Or what shall a man give in exchange for his soul? All gourds, fifteen dollars, except each view, forty dollars. Oh, is this the $40 best? Forty dollar gourd. That's pretty hefty. So we'll send. Yeah. No. Well, the long story short is, we're trying to find someone who's kissed their cousin, and he said. Bro, maybe maybe ease in that conversation a little slower, Tyler. They seem a bit hesitant on you even being there. And you say, I'm looking for a vegetable stand. Oh no, we don't got one. Uh well let me cut to let me cut to the chase. Have you fucked your cousin? You go to the vegetable stand. Is it a plant? Um, no, a human being. Can I interview uh, you on camera for ten dollars? How are you doing today? I'm doing good. Oh, what is your Oh, come on, dude. Name? My name is Jean. In your time in Alabama, have you met many people who have been in relationships with their family members? Like incest? Yeah. Um, not that I know of. Do you have any advice to someone who may be thinking about kissing their cousin right now? Please don't. You only have one mate in the world. That mate stays with you forever. Are you married? I've been I married. I think he's at the wrong house. I think Tyler turned into the wrong fucking home. Married 13 times. Want to see my marriage certificates? Sure. This is crazy. I've never heard of anyone that's been married this many times. Yeah, oh, you that's you marrying him three times. Yes. That's just one man. I tried and tried and tried. Yeah, you he just had to hit me in the head with an X to yeah. make me realize it. Yeah. Yeah, I married the same man three times. Okay. But God gave me partners to get through life, but you never have. He you hit he you in the head with an axe. The one, but once. Who was the one for you? My children's father. He was very evil and very harsh. Beat me. And the last time I was with him, he hit me in the head with an axe. 57 stitches. It scalped me. So yeah. that was it. Yeah. With him. My girlfriend recently broke up with me. And that hurts. Do you have any advice for me? Oh. Yeah, my last husband used to beat me and scalped me with an axe. Yeah, no, I, yeah, no, my girl dropped me too. Yeah, no, like.
No, I totally know what you mean, man. Like, I got dubbed the other day. It was just like, it was so fucked, bro. It was like, I couldn't handle it. Like, I just didn't really, I didn't really know what to do anymore. Only Jesus. Okay. Life is good. And uh, you just live it one day at a time. Thank you for sharing so much. Thank you. As I left Gene's house and headed to the southernmost tip of Alabama, I realized that love's more complicated than the Disney movies make it seem. Alabama's crazy. And oh, maybe I shouldn't be so quick to judge people, even if they do kiss their cousins. As I stared into the ocean, one Wondering where these Smurfs were hiding. Sure, sure. These guys offered me a beer out of nowhere. Robert, 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 yes, hey, oh, this is the one thing I liked about the South, bro. When I would go, I mean, the Florida doesn't really count as the South. But when I would go to Florida, bro, my God, I haven't been to Florida in like five years. When I used to go, though, you, dude, everybody, every day, every weekend, it would just be, it would be fucking big ass guys with like a beer belly. Just fucking blasting music, just sharing shit. That was nice. How you doing? Roll tight, man. Roll tight, man. Roll tight. All right on. Yeah, baby. So here's what we've been up to. Going around all around Alabama, trying to figure out if anyone's kissed their cousin. <laughs> I can't find this. You know all... what's crazy? Is there is there laws against driving a boat drunk? Be Florida's the most southern state. The reason I don't really call it the South, though, is because Florida it has a lot of people that just come from the north. Like a lot, like every other person you'll meet from Florida used to live in New York. Or like Pennsylvania. All the cash out of my By the grace of God, eleven dollars and ones made my dreams a reality. Yeah, baby, let's go. Oh my God, stop suspending. Get some love. Oh yeah, baby. Wait, what happened? I can't find it. What's up? Yes, yes. What's up? I got you too. I got. I'll give you all the cash out of my. By the grace of God, eleven dollars. We're gonna kiss each other for eleven dollars. Dollars and ones made my dreams a reality. Yeah, baby, let's go. Oh my God, stop suspending. <laughs> oh, yeah, baby. <laughs> nah, that ain't count. You got to get some tongue in there. You got <laughs> that ain't count. No, 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 no. That ain't count. I need to see the, I need to see the eye gaze. And then, <laughs> I'm going to move on. Fuck this. Fuck this. Get me out.